What's up guys, I'm Rhett. Welcome back to Lawn Insider. It actually turned out to be a beautiful day outside and I haven't gotten a mow in since Wednesday and today's Sunday. So me and my partner here are about to get out in the yard and get a mow in. Not too sure how well y'all are gonna be able to see this, but when I got the tape measure out, you can see I've actually got a few blades that are pushing that one inch mark. Not many, but there's probably a few and a few that are even poking over. This probably means that at least in some parts of the lawn, I'm gonna be breaking that one third rule because I mow at about a half an inch, a little bit over that. And one third rule just means that anytime you mow, you don't wanna be cutting off more than one third of the grass blade. And the reason for that is it's just harder for the plant to recover from that. And it is going to be more prone to scalping mowing that way. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull the mower out and I'll probably stop about halfway through the front yard just so y'all can see a side-by-side -side comparison of what the uncut side of the yard looks like compared to the cut side of the yard. And we're gonna go ahead and get this knocked out. All right, just got about halfway done with the front yard and I did want to show y'all. So I know most of y'all, you know, can't really tell when I mow how much I'm actually taking off. And I'm not taking off a whole lot, but you can see a very noticeable difference between the side that has been mowed and the side that hasn't been mowed yet. And today I'm just going with a pretty simple vertical stripe. That's probably the pattern that I mow with the most just because Basically, it takes the, the least amount of turns, and whenever you're mowing, your easiest route is gonna be the one that, that you have to turn the least. I do switch up the pattern, you know, pretty much every time I do mow, but if I'm just gonna go out for a quick mow, the fastest way I can do it is to do these vertical stripes. So anyway, here is a closer shot. So you can see, so this is the side that's been mowed, and this is the fuzzy side. We just finished up the front yard and I'm not sure if you could tell on video, but I actually did a double cut and all that does is kind of clean up any stragglers that we might have. And it came out nice. Let's go ahead and get the close up view. All right, let's head to the side.
Just finished up in the back and I also did a double cut back here. I did some single doubles back here just because I didn't want to turn a million times doing the same uh, vertical stripe pattern. So here is that. We've actually got a lot of shadows, so let me get closer. Okay, so you can kind of faintly see it, but a single double, I always do it to where the dark stripes, the doubles are coming back at us so we can see them from this side of the yard because that's the side that the sun is going to set on at my house. And here is the lawn. And as usual, give y'all a close-up shot of the turf. And we'll head back to the front. Thank you all for making it back another week. I am going to go ahead and wrap it up right here. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave it a like. If you're enjoying the content and you want to continue to see more of it, hit that black subscribe button below. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave those in the comment section below. I'll see you all again soon. Lawn Insider, out.